Kansas News Leader. The Topeka Symphony is back putting on the Ritz for its next performance. Conductor Kyle Wiley Pickett is here with all of the details. Welcome to you, sir. Thank you. And it is always fun because putting on the Ritz is the theme for the season. That's the theme for the How season. How are you carrying that out? What is the Well, goal? you know, all of our concerts this year have, uh, have elements from the Great American Songbook. And part of the reason for that was just because that was an era where we really needed fun. We needed entertainment. We needed things that would uplift us. And so our whole season this year is is on that theme. And so we've had already two concerts. We're already on our third concert of the year, which is a little bit unusual for us to be that far into our season by now. But we have a spectacular guest artist coming. You do? So who, do. who is it? Her name is Cheung Park, and she was our youth winner the year before I was hired. So I oh think my. about 12 years ago, she was the youth concerto winner here. She's from Lawrence and uh, played with the orchestra. Uh, I think it was the last concert the Topeka Symphony did before I arrived as music director. So I didn't get to work with her, but, uh, but we have kind of, we keep track of our former winners and she's one who's really gone out and made good she's gone off to the conservatory and got her degrees and and then she's won some major prizes and she's playing concerts all over and when i called i i said would you be willing to come back and play with the topeka symphony again she said she would love to so she's here with us this weekend well two things i love about this one is that it's just such a cool full circle moment it is but it also shows how giving young people an opportunity on the stage and to perform with your group can really inspire them for a lifetime yeah. because i would imagine something about that experience and being the youth winner really motivated her to continue her music career, yeah it's a which big is, it's a big deal for for our high school musicians because you know, there aren't that many professional regional orchestras that have a competition for high school age kids. And so, you know, a lot of orchestras have competitions, but they're for, you know, pre-professionals or, you know, people in, in grad school, that mm -hmm. kind of thing. So to, you know, imagine being in high school and then you get to stand in front yeah. of an orchestra of professional players and, you know, in front of a, a full audience. And so I'm thrilled that she's coming back to It'd play with fun. us again. What are a couple of the selections people might recognize that are going to be well? On your her playlist? piece is is probably the most recognizable. It's the piano concerto by Edvard Grieg, and and even if you don't think you know that, you'll you hear the beginning of it, and you're like, oh yeah, I've I've that heard one. this. It's it's played all the time. Um, we are doing a major symphony by Shostakovich on this concert, and the reason we're doing this symphony is specifically to showcase the talent of the players in the orchestra. Well, it is going to be fantastic. Mark your calendar Saturday evening. It's going to be rainy this weekend anyway. So head to the symphony Come 730 inside. Saturday night inside. at That's White right. Concert Hall. Go to TopekaSymphony.org if you would like your tickets in advance or of course you can be putting on the Ritz and buy the ticket for tomorrow. Yeah, Kyle, right. thank you. Always good to see you. Thanks so much. Great to have you along as well. Stay tuned for Investigate TV Plus. We'll be back with local news at five.